Hey on YouTube, Nick Pratap here from Next Gen Rehabilitation. And today I wanted to have a quick chat with everyone about exercise prescription in relation to individuals who are on uh, beta blockers. So I've had questions in the past from some of my patients and clients that uh, I've been working with in the hospital and the community about why they feel so fatigued or you know a little bit out of shape when they're on this medication. So I just wanted to break it down for everyone real quick. So the biggest reason that people or cardiologists put you on beta blockers is so that A, they can keep your blood pressure lower and B, they can keep your heart rate at a sustained level. Because of whatever episode you had going on, whether it had been open heart, uh, whether you suffer from hypertension, whether you have uh, some sort of arrhythmia, um, cardiologist's main goal is to protect the heart. And by dosing you with uh, a beta blocker, they're able to make sure that your blood pressure won't rise too high when performing some type of exercise or some type of physical activity. Now, what specifically happens uh, within the body? So in the heart, you have these uh, cells known as beta cells. And the beta blockers um, block these receptors and they prevent um, certain stimulants from uh, attaching into them. So if a stimulant attaches into a normal beta cell, it causes the heart to contract a little bit more forcefully, increasing blood pressure, increasing heart rate. Now, if you go ahead and take this beta blocker, it's going to inhibit that from happening, hence decreasing heart rate and decreasing blood pressure. Now, when performing certain exercises, um, a lot of patients will be like, well, you know what, it feels like I'm working so hard, but I can't get my blood pressure or I can't get my heart rate above 100. And that's totally normal. If you're on a beta blocker, and depending on what dosage of beta blocker you're on, like I mentioned uh, earlier in this video, the whole purpose of being on it is to prevent the heart rate from contracting too hard and too intensely, especially when performing specific exercises. So I don't want anyone to be alarmed, or you shouldn't be alarmed, um, if you're not finding that your heart rate is getting to a higher point. Uh, the main thing that you want to focus on is how you're feeling physically. Is this exercise challenging for you? And now we're actually going to talk about that in the next video on how hard um, individuals who have had a heart issue should be exercising, exercise prescription and exercise intensity. One thing people should be aware of though when they are on beta blockers is getting up uh, too fast. So your doctor might have mentioned to you, but um, if you're getting out of a bed, make sure you roll over onto your side and then get up slowly. Um, if you're getting off the floor, roll onto your side, push yourself up onto your knee, take a second if you feel lightheaded and then stand up. And this just goes back to the same scenario we already explained. These beta cells are blocked, so your heart rate isn't going to be able to pump as forcefully. Now, when you go ahead and stand up very quickly, gravity is pushing your blood down. Now, in a normal normal response, because you're not on beta blockers, you'd be able to pump this blood back to your heart. But because you're on beta blockers, it's preventing your heart from forcefully contracting, which means you're going to stand up, and it's going to take your body a little bit of time to, to, to pump that blood back to the heart because of the beta blockers taking an effect on your body. Um, and that's another reason why when performing exercises, you don't want to be working out too hard because a lot of people will try to push themselves even though they're not going to be able to get their heart rate to a higher intensity. And, you know, come later on that day, they're going to feel super tired. They may feel tired during their exercise. Uh, they might even feel extra tired the next day uh, because they totally exhausted their body, tried pushing it to a rate that they weren't able to because this medication is keeping you lower. So um, that's why when we run exercise treadmill tests, we ask our clients to, to make sure that they take their beta blockers so we can prescribe a specific heart rate range for them to be training at when, uh, when they're actually performing exercise uh, versus not being on a beta blocker. So hopefully that was you know able to answer a couple of the uh, questions that are coming at me from out there. And if you do have any more questions, please leave them in the comment section below. And like I said, the next video I will be making is going to be on exercise prescription for heart patients, um, specifically how hard you should be working out um, either on your own or when you're, you, uh, you're working out with either kinesiologist or exercise physiologist. All right, enjoy the rest of your day. Until next time, this is Nick Pratap from Next Gen Rehabilitation.